the topic of this um, of this session is to organise files using basic directory and folder structures. Why do we create files? As a record. Yeah, exactly. As a record. So why is it important that we carefully file the information that we create on the computer? So we can find it. Or so somebody else can find it. Yeah. That's right. For whoever's looking for the item. <laughs> That's exactly right. What are folders? What are folders on, on the computer? A folder on the computer is designed to store a series of documents in. These documents might be, once again, they might be Word documents, they might be Excel spreadsheets, they could be uh, oh, databases, they could be anything. Okay, subfolders. What are subfolders? Folders inside a folder. Correct, absolutely. In order to be able to organise things as systematically as we can, we may often need to break our information down into manageable chunks. You, you've just created a document here, you've written it all out, handwritten document, you're going to file it in your filing cabinet. Okay, it is a, what's it going to be? Car registration documents. How are you going to, how are you going to go about filing this? It should go into a car registration folder, which is then put under motor vehicles or something, a, a bigger heading, so that goes in there. True. Yeah. So, working with computer folders works exactly the same way. Having subfolders is good, having too many subfolders unnecessarily makes the job cumbersome and unnecessarily complicated. Give me an example of when in your work environment you'd actually want to move a move You forward. might want to hide something, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I deal with group home folders, so when yeah. uh, the manager changes or when there's a transfer or when the unit changes, then oh, all the staff files come and go. To, yeah, when right. staff come and go. Absolutely. Have to move, yeah, yeah. Okay, very yeah. good example. Thank you. You've just deleted a document. You. You think to yourself, this is a document that I really need, why did I do that? <coughs> Can you get it back? Is there a way to get it back? Mm -hmm. There is a way to get it back. <laughs> when you go, you will find on your, um, on your desktop you have a recycle bin. Oh, really? And if you go into your recycle bin and you find the document that you've inadvertently oh, deleted, no. you double click that document and simply choose the restore option. It will put it back precisely where it came Thank from. You. In this session, you've been able to organise and manipulate files um, using basic directory and folder, folder structures. Mm -hmm. you, uh, we've done it on a personal computer using Windows XP and Word 2003 by, by demonstrating the creation, the saving, the renaming, moving, deleting and restoring of Windows files and folders and we did it half an hour short of time, so well done. <laughs>